The fight of the decade is about to take place. KSI vs. Tommy D. KSI, the nightmare, or as we all like to call him, Ole Jinde Ole Tunji. Yeah, You're not KSI. Your name, mate. What is your real name? I'm I don't want to call you KSI. I want to call you by... Okay, well, yeah. I know you from... Try say now. that. ...are going to face each other this October, and we're going to finally see who's going to finish the job. Have you ever finished a guy off uh, to the body? Like Firstly, we take a look at KSI's tactics for the fight. We are gonna dive into the master plan, the strategy, the whole blueprint on how KSI is going to manage to knock out Stormy Fury. With KSI channeling his inner anime villain to warn Tommy Fury of his power. When I beat you, with every year that you breathe, that day will be a constant reminder that you lost to a YouTuber. You can train all you Shut like. up, you human pineapple. You look like a pineapple. Soon you will face reality and, and it will hurt you. The hairline's turned my old back. You will be a disgrace That's why he's to Fury Nate. <laughs> oh, and your boxing career Get will up be there, destroyed. My son. Get up there, my boy. You don't want this. As Even much as I do. WWE. You don't need this. As much as I do. <laughs> we're shaking. Oh, we're terrified. Oh, oh God. <laughs> I'll see you soon. <laughs> Did you help us? <laughs> what do you think Tommy does good? What do you think KSI does good? You know, I'm I'm pretty jealous of the fact that you don't have to bend over. If you mean that I've got long arms, yeah, basically, said, yeah, yeah. Know, I'm pretty, I'm pretty jealous. Yeah, I'll give you that. Thanks. Okay, so you got a long reach. What do you think, KSI does good? Yeah. Oh, you see? He... No, no. Hold on, hold on. I can get something. Out. Hold on. Oh, yeah. Come on. You got it. You got Inside it. Inside for the last fight. Come on. Come on. Bro. He throws the right elbow very well. Yeah. Sick. It was actually the left. But... First of all, JJ has to look fresh. So he starts off the day by visiting his favorite barber for a trim. Now I do not know the purpose of JJ's barber. Neither do I know why he gets paid. The type of aspirations, beliefs, hope and faith this man has in JJ's hairline should be studied. But goddamn nigga, just give up already. It's far gone. It's far gone. No recovery. And just like Samson had power in his hair. JJ has power in his forehead, so no wonder he keeps winning. <laughs> now, both KSI and Tommy Fury have to put in a lot of work in the gym for this fight, if they both want to win. KSI has the biggest advantage here, as Tommy Fury always keeps leg day. Making his body look like it was bit in the wrong format. But JJ knows the power comes from the legs. So he makes sure leg workout is his number one priority. Immediately he steps foot in the gym. Have you not seen the size of my balls, bro? Have you seen my balls? They're big and salty and brown. Ooh. If you ever need a quick pick me up, just stick my Basketball. Why does it? You don't like to touch balls? So I love it. So yeah, come, come and play. I mean, Jake Paul keep coming out with this. Jake Paul said he was going to do such and such a thing on fight week. Now you're talking about balls. Why is it for you guys? I'm not going to. Sucking Logan's too much. Uh,
too much. Uh, yeah, yo, what What's you going on, on here? I don't want to see you, what balls. You I want to see you in that ring on October 14th. Yes. Get you not out. Well, we'll see. Unlike KSI, Tommy Fury has one simple and clear tactic. Tearing you another asshole. Okay. Well, <laughs> I'll whip you another asshole. That's what you'll get. You, what? You, you ten stone weird. I will rip you a third ass on the manuscript. As Tommy Fury trains against any possible KSI counterattack, learning easily how to defend himself against KSI's knockout bar. Now, this is where KSI is disadvantaged. This is the reason why I think Tommy Fury will win this fight. You see, Tommy Fury has really long arms, which allows him to have a stronger reach for the lotion. Now, a lot of you boxing fans and critics are going to question me about this. But listen, you do not understand. If you are a fighter and you are a strong, committed member of the right hand community, it will only increase your striking abilities. Sam, like, here's the thing, guys. I'm going to give you some advice. <laughs> you guys got to jerk off. Like, like you got to jerk off once or twice a day, man. If you don't use it, you lose it. So, I'm also left handed, so that's why the, that's why my jab's so good. Tommy Fury, you've got really long arms. And that is how Tommy Fury managed to defeat Jack Paul, a man who is known for stepping into the ring and surmounting his legacy by completely defeating and destroying the senior citizens of the UFC. Old men who tried going the full extent of pushing their limits to see if there is any power left just to get knocked out by Jack Paul. He's not, he's not there to throw haymakers. Uh, and, and take silly chances, yeah. you know, he's, he's calculated. Thank you, Papa Fury! Daddy Fury, you're so nice! Daddy, chill. Thank you. Why am I so nice? You're just a, you're just a good dad. <laughs> yeah. The press conference was definitely one to watch, as KSI and Tommy Fury showed just how much they distaste each other, with one man in the crowd commanding JJ to grab his titties. Ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we have John Cena in attendance. Paul was different. I am the one that can see John Cena. John, what do you think about KSI? Um, I think Tommy Free is gonna come in from behind and come on his face. The one that knows what the dog is doing. You know, I'm that guy. I'm him. I'm him. When I go into a gym, treadmills do push-ups. Yeah, I'm the one that knows Victoria's Secret. Hey yo, these comments though. <laughs> Bro knows Victoria's secret. Bro was the first player. <laughs> Man still owes Jesus five dollars. And you broke a side, a side copy of the book. <laughs> Bro has hearing damage from the big bang. <laughs> As in John, you've obviously fought before, and after attending brutal injuries, you were supposed to be hospitalized, but you are now able to be seen in the ICU. Look at Cena! Cena ducked underneath it! Miz! Miz! Skull crushing finale! Miz, how could you? Watch this! Look at this! An A-list skull Boom. crushing finale! The Miz strikes again! What do you think about Logan Paul? Um, all he needs to do is not in her face so that she can no longer see men. Now she's a fucking angel. Like, all I want is like a big fat sausage. Sausage just destroying my body.
Me personally, I wouldn't take this level of disrespect. If you liked the video, please make sure to like, subscribe, and share. I'm out and peace. I'm a kid that I'm